So that's what we look at the other time. Not so members. Yes? Yes. Yes, so we, we know how to present, we know how to convert from coordinate form to column vectors, then displacement vector, then position what? Position vectors. We said for position vectors, which means the movement must have started from where? From the origin, which we write them, which is it? O, O, A. O, A is a position. O, A is a, is a position vector. O, B is also a position what? Vector. O, C is also a position what? Vector. Those are vectors. So as long as we have letter O, O is standing for the origin, okay? Then A, B, displacement vectors, we can put like A, B. This is a displacement. When we talk of displacement, as long as we have two points on a Cartesian plane and they're moving in the same direction, that we say that the vector has been displaced. Another word for displacement, another word for displacement, you can say it has been translated. It has been what? Translated, which means it has changed position. Okay, displacement is meant to change position right together. That's why we define it as the distance move in a specified direction. That one in the physics, but in mathematics, we prefer to as what translations right together. Yes. Good. Good. Now let's go straight on what we are what we are planned for today. Today we are going to look at operations, operations on operation on vectors. In mathematics, when we talk of operations, what do we mean? We refer to operations. When we talk of operations, we refer to we refer to we refer to what? Bodmans, okay? Bodmans. Yes, we refer to Bodmans. So which is the addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division, okay? Division. Yes. Now, to be specific in vectors, the operation that we shall look at, we shall not, we shall not look at, we, shall, we have already seen brackets, we shall look at brackets. We shall not look, what we are going to leave out under vectors is division. We cannot divide vectors, right, together? Yes. But we can add, we, look, we shall look at addition of vectors, addition of vectors. We shall also look at subtraction, Subtraction of vectors. Are you together? Yes. Yes. Now, when we come to mapication, 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 we have, we have what we call mapication, mapication by a scalar. Mapication by a scalar. Are you together? Are you together? Yes, teacher. Yes, so we shall look at addition of vectors, subtraction of vectors, then multiplication by applying a vector by a scalar. Are right, you together? Yes. Okay, let's start with the first one. The first one, subheading, can you write it down? Addition of vectors. Addition of vectors. We want to see how. How do we add vectors? How do we add vectors? Vectors. So we are saying we are saying vectors are, are added by adding respective what components are added by adding respective components or corresponding by adding corresponding corresponding elements. What does it mean? What does it mean? Can you write down? Suppose, 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 suppose vector A is equals to x1, y1, and, and B equals to x2, y2. Okay? I believe you're able to see from the notes. Okay? Yes. Yes. Now, when we add down these two vectors, so which is A nabla plus B nabla, we are adding the two vectors. So we are saying first to add vectors, we add the corresponding elements, which means we know that when we are writing them in column form, we write X and Y. So which means corresponding means we add X to X, Y to Y to Y. 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 Okay? So which means this one now we can write it as X1, which is A, then Y1 plus, okay? 
B, which is X2, Y what? Y2. Right, together. Now, to get, the, to get a single vector, which is A plus B, A plus B, we add X1 plus X2, which will give us X1 plus X2, corresponding elements. Then Y1 plus Y, Y2, like that. This is what we have. Are you together? Yes. Can you put it down, put it down, put it down? Uh -huh. That is for, that is for addition. That is for addition of vectors. Are we through with that? Are we through with that? Yes. Yes. Okay. Example. Yes. Let's look at example on that. Example. 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 Write down. Given that. Given that. Given that. Given that. Given that. Vector A is equals to. Vector A is equals to eight and two. And B equals to, and B equals to, B equals to one and a two. One and two, one and two. Full stop, fine, 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 A plus B. Find vector A plus vector B. Find A, vector A plus vector B. Following the same steps, we add by adding the corresponding elements, adding the corresponding component or elements. Are you together? Yes. Good. Uh huh. So we shall have. We know that A was given us. A was given us. A was given us eight and two. Eight and two. And B was given us. B was given us. One and, one, and two. one and two. Now they want us to operate A plus A plus B. Just recall, recall, to recall very fast, recall. We say that if I have X1, Y1 plus X2, Y2, when you add that one for vectors, you say adding the corresponding values X to X, Y2, Y, which will give us X1 plus X2, Y1 plus Y, Y2. Are you together? Yes. So in this case, which means 8 is going to give us, is going to present X1, not so. Then 2 is going to present Y, Y1. Are you together? Yes, just in a nutshell like that. So with me now, we can now say it implies now A plus B will be our A, which is eight and two plus, plus our B, which is one and a two. So when you put the corresponding elements together, which is eight plus one, eight plus one, then two plus two. What answer do you get? What nine. answer do you get? Nine out of four. Nine out of four, or nine, or nine and four. Nine, nine, nine and four. Is nine and four, not out of, okay? Yes. Yes, that is for, that is for addition. Is there any question on that? Is there any problem how we add vectors? No. That one is clear, right? Yes. Is that clear, members? Yes. Okay. Now let's go to two. B. Subtraction of vectors. We are going to be very time. Subtraction of vectors. Let's look at how we subtract vectors. Can we look at that, members? Yes. Yes. Who can take us through that? Yes. Who can take us through that? Read for me the, what is in the notes. In the notes, we said vectors are. Vectors are components. Are corresponding. corresponding elements. Okay. Uh, 
Please. So we are saying, suppose, suppose A, we are using the same example, which A is equals x1, y1, and B equals to x2, x2, y what? y2, like you are seeing from the notes there, right? So we are saying A minus B, A minus B will give us x1, y1 minus x2, Y what? Y2. Are we together? Are we together? So cor corresponding elements. Is it going to be X1 minus Y2? Eh? Is it going to be X1 minus Y2? No. No. What is it no. going to be? What is it going to be? X1, X1. minus X2. Uh-huh. Then? Y1 y minus Minus Minus. Y2. Like that. Not so. Yes. Yes. Put it down. Put it down. Put it down. I want to ask you. Have you put it down now? Yes. Okay. Yes. Example. 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 Let's look at an example. Example. Example, are you ready? Yes. Given that, given that, given that, given that, A, vector A is equals to X and Y, that's how they have given it, okay? Okay? Yes, yes. And, and vector B, and vector B, and vector B, is negative x, y. Is negative x, y. Okay? Are we together? Yes. Uh huh. Fine. 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 B minus A. Fine B minus A. So, what are we supposed to do there now? What about? Solution. solution, let's look at the solution. We have B minus A. So follow the order of the operations. Follow the order of the operation. Which means don't again interchange. Don't interchange them. Are we together? Are we together? Yes. Don't interchange them, please. So which means B must come first. So what is our vector B? Our vector B is it? Negative x, negative x, y. Not so. Take away a, which is x and y, which is x and y. So when you do that, you shall have negative x minus x. Are you seeing that? Negative x minus x, then y, y minus y. When, when you do that, what do you get? Negative x minus x, what do you get? Two X. We get negative two. Negative two, negative two X. X. Then, X. then Y minus Y. Y minus Y. Zero. We get zero. zero. Good. So therefore, therefore, B minus A is equals to negative two X. Zero. Is that okay, members? Yes. Yes. Okay. That was example number one. Yes. Number one. Number one. Example number two. Number two. Example number two. Number two. Please, someone is next to. Next to a TV, a, I'm getting a lot of feedback. 
Okay. Uh huh. Given that, number two, given that, given that, given, given that, vector P, vector P is equals to three and two, and, and vector Q, and vector Q is equals to one and, one and zero, is one and zero. Okay. Fine. Fine. Roman one. I'm going to combine now all the all the two parts we have learned. Okay. Fine. P plus Q. Roman two. Two. P minus Q. P minus Q. Is it okay, members? Yes. Okay. Yes. Work it out. Work it out. What, when you work it out, what do you get? Roman one. Roman one is addition, right? P one plus two is equals. I said don't change the order, okay? So which means I'll have three and two plus plus one and zero. One two. What do you get? Three plus one. We get, we get four. Then two plus zero. Two. We get two, sorry, we get two. So which mean P plus Q is equals to four and four and four two. and two. Four and two. Remember, this is mathematics. Underline your answer. Don't forget that, please. Underline your answer, please. And don't forget to put this symbol. I said this symbol is called what? This symbol is called what? Nabla. 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 It is used to present vectors, so don't forget it, okay? Yes. We use Nabla when we are using a single letter. When we are using a single letter. Letter. But when we are combining letters, like if I have like PQ, now there is it, we use the R on top. Are you together? Yes. Yes, for single letters, we use Nabla. For single letters, we use Nabla. Then for combined letters, we use arrow. Okay? Yes. Okay. Yes. yes. Go to Roman 2. Work out Roman 2. Roman 2. In Roman 2, what do we need? What do we want in Roman 2? Is P, P minus, minus Q. Vector P minus vector Q, right? Q. Uh huh. What is our vector P? What is our vector P? Is three and two. Take away. Three and two. Take away. Take away. One what? and zero. One and zero. One and. Who has got the answer already? Who has got the answer? Who has got the answer? Two and two. two. Me. Two yes. and two. Is it? Two and two. Is two and two and two. two. Now there's something also I want you to investigate. I want you to find out something. Roman three, add Roman three, okay? Uh huh. What about Q minus P? Do we get the same answer? Let's prove that one. Let's investigate that. What about Q minus P? Do we get the same answer? So we shall no. ask. Uh huh. Let's investigate that. Uh huh. What do we get? One zero, not so minus yeah. minus three and three two three and two. two. So we shall have one minus three, then zero minus two. What do we get? Negative two, negative. negative two. Negative two, negative two. Eh? Negative. negative two. What have you discovered? What have you discovered? When is P minus Q, we have all, all we are positive. Are you seeing that? They are the same in magnitude. Yes. Are you seeing that? Was two and two. Okay. Then when we reverse the order, we got negative two, negative two. What does it mean? Which means that we have changed the direction. Remember that. We said for vectors, when you reverse the direction, it becomes a negative. Okay? Yes. 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 
Are you together, members? Yes. Any questions so far? Any questions so far? No. Am I loud? No. And, no. Am I loud and no. clear? Am I loud and clear? Yes. 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 Okay. We are moving to the next concept. Yes. Which is it? Multiplying a vector by a scalar. Can you write that heading? C, concept C, multiplying, multiplying a vector, multiplying a vector by a scalar. Multiplying a vector by a scalar. Who can remind us? What is a scalar? We know what a vector is. What is a scalar? Ready, ready, ready. Yes, teacher. What is what is the scala ready? What is the scala? Hmm? Ready. What is the scala? Teacher, I don't know. Ah, you hear ready? You hear ready? Someone to help ready. Miriam, Miriam, Miriam. Yes, teacher. What is what is the scala? I don't know. Ah, you hear them. Have you joined for the first time? You have just started, eh? Yeah. Okay. Yes, Beatrice. What is the scala? A scala is is a is a physical quantity with only the magnitude. With only the what? The magnitude. Ready. The magnitude. Ready. Yes. Have you got it now? Yes. Repeat, repeat it for us. A scala is a. Mm -hmm. A scala is a physical quantity with only a magnitude. With only magnitude. Can you clap for ready? Hmm? Okay. A scala. A scalar is a physical quantity with only what? A magnitude and has no direction, okay? It has no direction. Now, this time we want to multiply, we want to combine a scalar and a vector, okay? A scalar and a vector. What do we get? When you multiply a, a vector with a scalar, you still get a vector, right together? Yes. Members? Yes, teacher. Vector. Okay, a vector time a scalar, a vector time a scalar must give you, must give you what? A vector, okay? A vector. Are you together? A vector time a yes. scalar give you a vector. Remember we said my application, my application associative, my application are associative. So you can have a scalar, a scalar time a what? A vector, you still get a what? A vector. You still get a vector. A vector. Are you together? Yes. Uh -huh. Back yes. to our notes. Back to our notes. We said, let suppose we have vector A. Suppose, right? Suppose, suppose we have a vector A, vector A, which is given by, which is given by, let's just say X and Y. Are you together? Suppose we have vector A equals to X. Are you together? Mama, what the one? And 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 a scala and a scala k and a scala k. So k is k is our scala. Beatrice. Yes, sir. Beatrice, can you can you pay attention, please? You are distracted. Uh huh. We are saying suppose we have a vector a, which is given by x and what y. Then a vector, which is k. K, we are just we can use any letter to mean a scalar. To mean as to mean a scalar. We can use letter k, we can use h, we can use a number. All we still represent, all we still mean what? A vector. Are we together, members? Are we together? Yes. Yes, Now we are saying, suppose now if I have k a, k a, k is a scalar, right? K is a what? Yes. K is a scalar. A scalar. A is a what? A vector. 
And I said, when we multiply a scalar and a vector, what do we get? We get a vector. vector. A vector. So which means in this case, K into our vector A, vector A is which is defined by X and what? Y. Are you together? Y. So this scalar is going to yes. be multiplied. This scalar is for X and Y. It's for X and what? Y. Y. So which means when you expand, when we what? Expand, it will give us K Ex time. K, K time X will give us X, K what? KX. KX. Then K time Y will give us K, K what? KY. KY. So that's what we call, that's what we call scalar multiplication of vector. A vector. This is what we call a scalar multiplication of vectors. A vector. Are you together? Are you together? Yes. yes. So yes. we are saying in the notes, in the notes, we are saying here we style. Oh, no, with that, when we multiply, when we multiply a scalar <laughs> by a vector, <laughs> we still obtain a what? We still obtain a vector. That one, that one, I've, that one I've already explained it, right? No. <laughs> yes. Example. Gonna... Example. Let's go to example now. Example. Example. <laughs> I'm not looking at the question, which the one you have, I'm giving you another one. I'm giving you another one. Okay? Okay, yes. The question is, given that, given that, given that, given that, <laughs> are we ready? Given, yes. given okay. that, given that, vector A is equal to, Vector A is equals to three and negative two, three and negative two, and B vector B is equals to negative one, negative one two. Okay. Yes. Uh -huh. Roman one, Roman one, fine, fine, Roman one, fine, Roman one, three. 3P, I mean 3A, find 3A, find 3A, Roman 2, 30 minutes, mm -hmm. well, then, then find, then find negative, negative 2, B. negative 2, B. Are you together? Yes. yes. Okay, I can remove mine, mine is full, I can remove. Uh huh. Let's answer. Uh huh. Can we find a solution for that? Solution. So to be consistent, what was vector A? Vector A was given to be. Vector A was given to three be three negative two. Three negative. Three negative two. And B was given to be. What about B? Negative one. Two. One two. Negative one and two. Then in part one, they want us to find three. Three. So in this case, what is three? In this case, what is three? Is three a vector or a scalar? Scalar. Is three scala. a vector or a scalar? Scalar. Scalar. Scala. Scala. Then a is it? A is it? A vector. Is a vector. So it implies that three a is going to be equal to three in two. Okay. Our vector A, which is three and a two. Not so. Uh -huh. We said the scalar is going to multiply all the elements in the vector, right? So what do we get? Three times three, three times three, then three times nine, three times two, right? Which will give us, which will give us Three times three, nine. Then this one is what? Six. Do we have that? Yes. Is it okay? Yes. yes. Very good. Uh huh. Then then Roman two, Roman two, Roman two. What do they want us to find in Roman two? Negative two, negative two B. Uh huh. So we know that this one is going to be the same as negative two B 
is going to be negative 2b will be equals to negative 2, 2 which is a scalar into what is our vector b? Is negative 1 and 2. Not so. So we shall have yes. negative 2 times Sorry. negative 1. Okay. Then negative 2 times 2. Are you together? Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. What have you got, Bernard? What have you got? <coughs> negative two times negative. Two. Uh huh. We get two and negative negative four. Two and negative four. Good. Negative <laughs> four. Two and negative what? Four. Negative, uh. negative four. Any questions so far? Any questions so far? No. No. Okay, if there are no questions, now let's go to more examples. What we call more what? Examples. More examples. Now, we have seen we have seen how to add, we have seen how to subtract, and we have seen how to multiply a vector by a scalar, right? Yes. Now I want yes. to I want to give a question now which will combine all the three concepts together. All the three concepts. Okay. We shall add, okay. we shall subtract, then we shall multiply by a scalar. And the question is right there with you. I think the question on the screen, the question on the screen, that example there. On the notes, on the side of the notes. Have yes. You seen that? Yes, you write that question down, write it down, write it down. So. Yeah. They have said that given that A is what? A is three and a two, okay? Then B, our B is it? negative four, negative one, and vector C, and vector C is given to be zero and, and five, right? Yeah. Uh-huh. Roman one, they want us to find A plus B. Work it out, work out that one very fast. I'm waiting for the answer. Work it out, I'm waiting for the answer. Don't, don't, don't look at what I'm writing. Don't look at what I'm writing. You work out yours, work out yours. Uh -huh. <laughs> I want to see whether you will get the same answer. Are you getting the same answer like the one on the screen? Yes, teacher. You, you are getting negative one and one, right? Yes, yes. teacher. Yes. Uh -huh. Go to Roman two. Proof Roman two. Are you getting the same answer like the one on the screen? Roman two. Is it okay in Roman two? Is it Roman? Is Roman two okay? Yes. What about Roman three? Go to Roman three. Go to Roman three. In Roman three, we have. Roman three, we have vector B minus vector C plus vector plus vector A. Can you work it out and prove that whether the answer is negative one and negative four? Work it out. Yes. You get the same answer, eh? Yes. Members, are we together? Yes, teacher. Hmm? Bernard. Bernard. Yes, Anua. 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 Adikini. Adikini. Yes. Are we together? Yes, teacher. Excuse oh. me, yes. teacher. Yes. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, but Roman, teacher, Roman, teacher, Roman two Roman. is wrong. 
is wrong. Roman two is wrong. It's three negative. It's three negative. Yes. Okay, you correct yours. You correct it. Correct it. Have you corrected it? Yes. Okay, now let's go to Roman four. Let's go to Roman four. <coughs> Roman four, we have four vector A minus B. So when, when you look at Roman four, how many operations are there? When you look at Roman four, how many operations are there? Two. We have? Two. Which one and which one? Two. Which one and which one? Multiplication by a scalar. By a scalar and then subtraction. Then what? Subtraction. Subtraction. So which means we allow 4a minus b will be give us 4 into vector a, which is 3 and what? 3 and 2 minus 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 b. What is our b? B is negative 4, negative 1, right? Yes. Uh huh. So we start by first opening. We first expand this by opening this. Okay, by taking the four inside. So when we take four inside, what do we get? We get, we get twelve, right? Twelve. Twelve yes. and what? Eight. Twelve, and, twelve eight. and eight minus negative four and negative one. Uh huh. So twelve minus negative four. Then eight minus negative one, right? So write it like that to make yes. it more simpler, to simplify it. So when you simplify that, now you have to okay. remember our integers, remember integers, members. When a negative and a negative is combined, what do we get? Positive. Positive. So which means this one will give us 16, right? 16. Then this one will give us? Nine. Nine. Okay, now we shall take a short break. We shall take a short break, then we come back, okay? Yes. Yes. Is there any question yes. so far? Yes. Is there any question so far? Is there any question? No. We are moving mm -hmm. on. We are moving on well, right? Yes. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Teacher. Yes. What? Are we coming yes, yes. Are we coming back? A break of only two minutes. After two minutes, join back. A break of only two minutes. Okay. Yes. Two minutes, we join back. Are we together, members? After two minutes, join back. Don't delay. Don't delay so that you don't miss.